everyone, this is Argon Matrix, welcoming you to episode 33 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. Blind all of a sudden. Oh my god. And we're gonna go ahead and do some more of these mini games. I know you guys are probably just, like, yelling at your screams at me. Ye yelling at your screams. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> yelling at your screens at me. Rainbow Falls, okay. To go, to go back to Spaceland to get back on with, like, the interesting new levels instead of these old mini games. These old mini game farts. Fart munchers. Defeat 20 enemies in a minute 30. Not so bad. Oh, but I just want to get all these out of the way. You know, like, save the best for last kind of thing is what I'm going for here. Dude, don't even concentrate on the beads. Don't worry about it, man. It's not like we're in Beadrix, Beadrix's minigame here. They got minigames for, like, everything. This is crazy. Dude, I want to kill you. Thank you. We'll kill you. Alright, oh, we got the alligator guy. Man, it's been a long time since I've seen him. Kind of miss him, actually. Not gonna lie. They're so funny. They've got just big, wide mouths, as real alligators do. Oh, is this guy gonna die? He might have just died on his own there if I just let him fall into that pit, but I don't trust it. I don't trust the game to kill an enemy for me in, like, this minigame. Don't know why. I just don't. Alright, there we go. Man, that was swift killing right there. Swift killing. Alright. Oh, he looked so sad when I killed his, uh... Did he die down there? I'm not sure if he did. Because I don't think I saw the death counter go up up there. Alright. Well, that was two for one. Two for the pipes of one, Grandma. Dude, that guy's just hovering there. That's not physically possible. You're crazy, Marty! Alright, I'm just gonna do this. Oh yeah, man, that was a triple kill. Or quadruple kill, even, I think. c c, -c combo breaker Yeah, I didn't kill that one guy. Can I go back and get him really quick? Go, go, go! Wait, he didn't respawn. Oops. So you can't let them fall into the pit. Okay, I just learned that lesson the hard way, I guess. I don't know if I'll show that off. Yeah, if I don't show that off, by the way, um, I kind of failed that because I let one of the enemies fall into the pit, and that doesn't actually count as a death. Even though it counts as a death when I... Actually, no, it doesn't count as a death when I do it. So never mind. Oh, man. Kirby logic. Crazy, crazy Kirby logic. Or is it yarn logic? Because I don't know. Because the logic in this... You can actually die in other Kirby games, so... Maybe it's just yarn logic. This guy's just sleeping. Killed in your sleep. That's the way to go. For sure. If I... When I... I was about to say, if I ever die. Yeah. Don't get cocky now, dude. Yeah, when I die, I'd like to die in my sleep. That would be just great. Because that's like when you're you want, when you're at your most peaceful and when you're just not cognizant of anything. You don't even know that's supposed to happen. So it's just like... Oh. It's just like, bring it on when... I won't even know what hit me. Alright. Gotta get this guy and this guy. Nope. Man, I threw it diagonally there. Did you see that? That's something I didn't know how to do until just a few videos ago. Oh, yeah. Gotcha. G -g -g gotcha. Bop. Alright, ooh, got the crystal star. Hell yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna go for another quadruple kill up here again, if I can get this guy. Yeah, because last time when I did this, I don't know, I still don't know if I'm gonna cut it out or not. I probably will, just for the time's sake. Yeah, but he got a quadruple kill right there. You kill, like, two alligators and two waldies all in one fell swoop. Man, why am I saying that expression so much? One fell swoop. And we got another Buster Sage to handle. Dude, Buster, you look too much like Zeke for my liking. You're like a combination of Zeke and Carrie. It's kind of unnerving, actually. Is that a Walla D fabric? I, it is, I called it. Man, they all look so happy, but they also look very fat on that wall fabric. Alright, let's go again, Buster. Pyramid Sands. Getting up into the world, too, shenanigans now. Oh, we're gonna have to go through every single world, aren't we? <laughs> I hope there's not like 20 million of these stages. Alright, 10 enemies, 10 enemies in a minute 30. Rock on. Rock on, Rock Hawk. Alright, there's a mummy right here. I'm gonna kill you with your own gauze. Ha ha. Alright, oh boy. That looks fun. Mind if I enjoy your bow? While you die? Alright, oh, I have to kill this guy, don't I? I'm sure I do. Oh, I just killed him. There you go. It doesn't really matter if I, like, kill enemies by actually like, running into them and hurting myself. Because that's still, like, killing them and it just loses me beads, which I don't even need, really. Not in this minigame. 
Alright, dude, I was trying to throw that thing up at him, but apparently you can't throw while throw something while you're in a cyclone. I guess that makes sense, kind of. To be honest, though, I don't really know if it makes sense. I've never been in a cyclone and tried to throw something. I've never been in a cyclone, period. And I hope never to have to go in a cyclone. Boom, daddy. Alright, just these two guys left to kill, or this one guy left to kill, I mean. Oh, dude. And he hits me with his arrow just before I'm about to kill him. You know what? Fuck you! There we go. You defeated ten enemies. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna go do a Mara stage now. Maybe that's how I'll do it. I'll do like two Buster stages and then two Mara stages. Just so like, we can get a good fill of Buster and then get a good fill of Mara and get a nice diversity group going on here. Uh, it might take a few seconds longer, a few minutes longer, just from the transit. The Mummy Mania fabric. <laughs> Yeah, so, let's go. Go see Maratona. <laughs> Maybe that's her full name, Maratona. Maratona del Roma. Oh, my dad's a marathon runner. He's good at it. He's good at it, too. Mm. He's brought up the idea that maybe me and him could run a marathon at some point in our lives, like, together. Oh, I think there's, like, one marathon that he wants to, like, run with me. And it's, like, the... It's like the four deserts. I'm not sure exactly what it's called, though, but it's like the four deserts, and there's like four deserts that you cross. I know one of them is the Sahara, one is the Gobi Desert, I think. I'm not sure what... I can't remember what the third one is. And then the fourth one is the Antarctic Desert, which is a scary thought, but... <laughs> it is technically considered a desert, so there you go. Alright. See, this kind of marathon I can do, though. I don't know if I can do that kind of, like, desert marathon, but marathon in a video game? No problem, man. I got pr plenty of practice against Il Piantissimo, so I'm good. Is this the level where I get to transform into a tank? I, I wonder if I get to do that in the marathon. Probably not. <laughs> that would be good, but probably not. I wouldn't bet my bottom dollar on that. Oh my god! <laughs> oh wait, no, I don't want to be stuck in the clouds. Crap. I didn't realize I would be stuck in the clouds, so that water spout actually kind of screwed me there, even though it was really fun to ride. Alright. Gotta get in here and get up. Up. Up and away! No, she's passing me! Holy crap, she's gonna pass me! Oh, she waited for me. Oh, she's taking a break! Okay, she takes breaks periodically. That's why. I, that's how I was staying so far ahead of her. Alright, yeah, this is where I would normally transform, I guess. is right where the ghoul actually is. The ghoul. Did I say that? Sorry, I was like wiping my nose while I said goal. And so when I wiped my nose, my wrist got all over my mouth and it covered it. So I was like, ghoul. And it sounded kind of like ghoul and goal at the same time. Sorry for that. Uh, that's a pukey green fabric. Kind of nasty, I'm not going to lie. It's the green star fabric. Oh, man. I wonder if there's 242 of those on there. Actually, just no, 120. But you know what the illusion was there, I hope. Flower fields, man. Oh, this is the most Kirby level in the whole game. This is like the stereotype level of the whole game is flower fields. I only say that because the... Like the the image for Flower Fields that they were showing in the screenshot for this marathon thing was the screenshot of my very first video, I think, in Kirby's Epic Yarn. It might have been the second video, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, crap! I didn't want to go down here. Oh, well. I'm sure I can still make it quite just fine. I'm sure I can still make it quite just fine. That was great English right there. Yeah, don't listen to me for English lessons seriously now. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's go right down here. And I guess I have to go down through the water, right? Right? Right. So it's not a marathon anymore, it's a triathlon. You should change, change your name to Triath, I guess. <laughs> it's a stupid joke. I know it is, but I can't help it, you know. Alright, are we just about there? Not quite? Okay. Or a ways ahead of her still. I don't want to beat her by too much. I don't want to make her feel bad about herself. Oh, uh, yeah, there we go. I win! Man, she always makes it look like it's such a close call there, too. Like, she gets there at the very end. It's like she gives one final burst. It's like, fart! Fart like you've never farted before! And you get there. Uh, it's like I'm the postman in Ocarina of Time or something. It's like, oh, sorry, I got here just one second before you. Exactly. Every time. Every god. Is that the gold star fabric? No, it's the honeycomb fabric. <laughs> I was about to say there for a minute. Uh, what are we in Mario Galaxy all of a sudden here? Uh, what did we switch LPs all of a sudden? Or did we switch from an LP to an LC? Uh. 
Loading. I should really cut out those loading times, shouldn't I? They're not that long, I guess, but... they I guess they have consumed a fair their fair chunk of video time in this whole LP. Alright, this is probably the last minigame I'm gonna... The last minigame I'm going to get to do. I need to enunciate my words much better when I talk. I've been slurring and mumbling a lot lately in my videos, and I'm trying to remedy that. 15 enemies in 2 minutes, 30 seconds. Go. Let's do it. <laughs> Dude. He almost sort of ran headlong into that octopus's, like, powdery flakes. Alright, let's kill him, though. Oh, dude, I missed! Oh my god. I missed! No crap, get off me! I forget, can I grab this guy? I don't even rem remember. Okay, I'm not gonna get it this time. Certainly not. Alright, I can kill him like that, though, so that's good. Good to remember for next time when I actually get to do it right. Because I totally screwed that up just now. Oh, crap. Oh, I hope not all the enemies in this are octopi. That'd be scary. It looks like they all are, though. Oh, my God. That's kind of funny. I don't know what constitutes funny here, though. Oh, it's not funny, because there is a... Uh, there's some waddle doos around here now, and a snail. Okay, they're not... <laughs> so they're not all octopi. Oh, and there's a bee there, too. Well, way to prove me wrong. All in just, like, one fell swoop. Is that my new catchphrase or something? One fell swoop. You can't take an expression like that and turn it into a catchphrase. An expression that was already an expression to begin with. You can't turn it into a catchphrase. That doesn't work like that. Sorry to say. I could still do it this time, I guess. If I play my cards right here. That was kind of nice. The way I killed that waddle do. I don't know what was, what was exactly nice about it. It's like, oh, you pressed a button at the right time. How good for you. There we go. That was a little bit dangerous there. I could have just gone plummeting all the way to the bottom there as soon as I, if I had, like, missed them, but... Nope. I was good. I was good. And... Dude, I missed some enemies. Oh my god, there's one. I see him. Alright. That's... Alright, I'm still missing one, though, and that's kind of unnerving, because I have no idea where he is. Come on, buddy. Show yourself! Make yourself known, and I can kill you with this. Oh, he's in there. Oh, crap. How am I going to do this now? Shit. Um. Did I just screw myself? I think I just screwed myself, guys. Because I have nothing to pick up to throw in there. That's really bad. Oh, my God. I can't do it. I can't do it. Thanks, everyone, for watching. This is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.